so what I'm doing, uh, I'm collecting the cow dung to go feed the biogas digester. Uh, I did a video about a uh, few months ago, not sure of the month. But I was explaining not how the biogas works, but uh, I came to realize that I didn't do a video of how we feel the cow dung. So that's exactly what I'm doing to feel the biogas with the cow dung. This is the cow dung. scoop it with a with a spade then Come and feed it right here so that uh, I'll not come in mix with water and place it right here, like uh, I had explained. Right here. To get the, the cow dung at the edge, you have to come to in the cow shed itself and use this kind of tool to push the dung. And I'm pressing right the edge. So I'm supposed to push it right here. This one will go to the garden, it will, be, it will be used for farming. But for me to accept it easily to fetch and take it to the biogas digester, I have to put it at the edge so that I can fetch it or collect it at the convenient point. Because this one is like a swamp. You can see it right here. If you are not here. Alright. Uh, the cows the one two three and the fourth one so this is the point we milk the cows It's over full. Uh -huh. I'm putting this in here. It's just on the transient because the, this one is very dim. So that I can get enough grip. It's almost full.
Hey, what's up guys? Welcome again to my channel. Uh, this is another section of the video that I've had uh, shown you. Me putting uh, the cow down in this market. And I want to feed it in the burgers digester. So, what we do is we mix this cow down with water with a ratio of 1 is 1. Uh, so, it's already mixed with water. So you take a stick like this one and you start the mix. I had already put water before and uh, also it rained at night so some of the water got in but it is okay. So you mix, you get like a porridge like consistency or somehow smooth. Then you take a bucket like this and we place and uh, place the the in the in the mouth of the bio biogas digester. So let me get to action and uh, hope you learn from this video. If you have cows, you are feeding cows, uh, or let's say you are keeping cows, that is, you can invest in such kind of uh, uh, digester and it will give you two hours trust me two hours of cooking for uh, for, for for a day that is <laughs> two hours of cooking the gas for a whole day yeah so let me start uh, putting it here uh, like the video uh, comment down below and subscribe if you haven't yeah that's very important that's the only way you can support this channel because we do a lot <coughs> i'm trying a lot to give you content and i hope you like this video so subscribe if you haven't support me that's the only way you can support this village boy <laughs> let me get into action you can see right here is the mouth of the digester and this right here is a the one that crosses you can see this point we put it like that see it pushes then it locks but uh, although I had done a video explaining you can hear this is where the slurry slurry is the waste or the cow dung mixed with water after the gas has been extracted you can see it goes through here this is where it comes from then it gets in through here it falls here then there's a pipe that passes under the digester and goes to the chamber or the garden and this one is very healthy for the plants we use it to do farming it's very healthy you can hear the the rumbling and this right here is the biogas filter this way it's filtered and this pipe goes that way you can see this probably going that way it goes to the to the kitchen to the biogas burner that's where we do the cooking so let me get into action and place the cow down in the mouth of the digester so that more gas can be processed because we are supposed to put two buckets of cow down each day to get to get a consistent amount of gas when cooking you know it's very frustrating when you're cooking and then the gas finishes that's the last thing that you can wish for, especially if you are cooking ugali, a heavy meal. Or maybe you have visitors. So that's why we place each day. So let me do the action. So that's it. You can see this fresh cow dung uh, that I've placed over here. It has gone to the digester. 
and the aluminum with some here. See, those is water, this mixture of water and powder. And then after I finish, I have to rock this. It goes in there, the rocks. So nothing else can get in here apart from what you have placed, which is powder. By the way, uh, cow dung is not the akish. You can even touch with your heart. Uh, I'm not sure of how that came to be, but for cow dung, you can even touch. You can step. You you can even stay in there and you don't feel the smell. So that's the most uh, you know fascinating thing about cows. They are amazing animals, and. Uh, they are very beneficial in our life as you can see they provide us with gas milk meat you know they are domestic animals so when they, they are out the homestead you feed some sort of company if you are alone yeah and uh, they also provide us with money after we sell the milk yeah it's a form of business so they are amazing so i'm done putting the biogas i, I did a video explaining about the biogas digester uh, some months ago, not sure how many months. So if you have not watched that video, that, that, uh, you have not watched that video, I'll link it at the top, top right corner of your screen. You can click, go watch it, learn about the burgers digester. Then you come and watch this video of me placing the cow down. It was right here, uh, then to there, and uh, as you saw from the start of the video, I was taking it from the cow shed, and you come to this video and learn. You can also decide to invest in it it saves a lot so thank you for joining me in this video i read this video right here i hope to see you in the next video take care and see you peace